some milk. Is this video? We got this rapper can't stop lying after falling off. Lil Pump, Lil Pump, Lil Pump. Oh, I already know. I already know. So around a month, it's just a song. That's all. Nothing even special. That's the issue. I'm saying. I'm saying like add something, bro. I go. I made a video about this Florida rapper named Florida. Kid Trunks. Kid Trunks. Oh, that's not. That's not good. He's from Florida. Never mind. I thought we were talking about Lil Pump. Wait, you playing games tonight? Yeah, probably. He used to be affiliated with the. Who the fuck is this nigga? All right, y'all, be serious, bro. Who is this? XXX Tentacion, and he was even in his group. The Kid Trunks. Are you for real, bro? Like, who? Who? Nigga. Members only rap collective. You know, back then this guy was living high on the. So he was like the shadow of fucking. He was always in X's shadow, and then when X passed away, he got he went away too. Like basically. You don't know Kid Trunks? No, nigga. What? Like, be for real. Have you oh. ever heard a nigga say, yo, play that Kid Trunks? Uh. Pretty much riding XXX's coattails. But nowadays, just like most men. What happened to this man? What happened to him? Members of the Members Only Rap Collective, this guy is pretty much irrelevant and clout chasing on a whole nother level. Because oh. back when I made the video about him around a month and a half ago, this guy was running around saying that he had some sort of rare pneumonia chest cancer, which what I personally fuck? had never heard of. You know, rare I pneumonia up, the chest community can had not chest heard cancer. of it as well. So not what only fuck? was he saying he had this very rare cancer and that he had about a 2% chance to live, but he also <laughs> said he- <laughs> Nigga said two percent chance <laughs> no one no one is making it on a two percent chance but come on bro be serious that boy was playing a lottery at that point cured of this come on. cancer only seven weeks later after constantly spending time in the icu the whole thing seemed very suspicious to me and apparently a lot of his fans as well because they've been calling him out like crazy ever since i mean he can't post a single picture on instagram without the comments being flooded with people talking shit and apparently he didn't learn his lesson you know this guy is like a clout goblin and so he's back to gobble up some clout and it's led to a situation bro think he walter white yo um like for real bro come on he really clout chasing at that point where his fans are once again saying that he's lying about being involved in a brush with death it all really started when he posted this pic what the fuck that don't even look real i mean okay you're on his instagram you guys really keep this image in your head because he's alleging that this is a gunshot wound this nigga was got shot in his chin and put a band-aid over it the original caption on that picture pray for me fam. that nigga gotta be a fucking super soldier or some shit boy what only almost died two times and it's only been three months of 2022 because that almost died two times bro uh, bro is playing life on hard mode what the fuck Dude, shake my head first this cancer shit and now this bullshit put the guns down man this shit real out here so this first shit he real has out cancer, here. now he's going for the whole gun violence angle. I mean, this guy is really trying to complete the whole trifecta. And just right <laughs> off the bat, you know, there's a lot of evidence here to suggest that he didn't actually get popped in the face. A fan apparently popped screen record this crazy. with Kid Trunks apparently went live like 30 minutes after he posted that saying that he was popped in the face. And as uh -huh. you guys can see from the video, his face looks fine. There's nothing wrong with his chin at all. That Going boy live for capping. a whopping 273 people. Ooh. So that's kind of the first I mean, hey, that that's still is better than what I'm doing. So I mean, I can't really say anything. I mean, he didn't get shot in his job, but he would have that have that whole his exactly who took a pic of him though. He himself probably. You know, this is all mere know? speculation, guys. This Maybe. is all my opinion. He also posted some pictures where he was saying that these different celebrities were checking up on him, uh, including Billie Eilish, apparently. Where he says, "Love you always and forever, Billie Eilish. Thanks for the imagine. Check imagine Billie came out like, I don't know you, my nigga." Yo, that would be crazy. Apparently, Young Thug checked in as well. Apparently, right, Trippy Red got him on the phone. 
and even T.I. himself, okay, apparently gave him a FaceTime Nigga. call. Something <laughs> that his fans did notice was peculiar about these pictures was that his hair changes colors on every FaceTime call. You know, it goes from being blonde there to, like, light red. To All right, that's kind of like, damn, you watching that hard, my nigga? All right, let's calm down. The Niggas is black dick eating now. Red, so, but still, you know, this, this guy is apparently weird. got shot in the face and then went to color his hair the next day. Also, to further prove those pictures were bullshit, there's the picture where he says Billie Eilish was calling him, checking up on him, and there's the actual uh -huh. FaceTime where this original photo comes from. Pretty sure it might have been. Nah, that's kind of that's weird as fuck. That's weird. In one of those trends where you the call the celebrity fuck? and they're like, "Oh no, you called me." Oh oh oh. And here's where the wheels really start to fall off for Kid Trunks. This guy, That's DJ Dabs, who apparently shit, was also affiliated with XXX's group, was, he says this is this literally nigga? a lie. He slipped and fell in the airport and busted his chin. Does that... Damn. I ain't gonna lie. If one of my niggas do this, boy, damn. His, his, his bro, his bro outed him. Damn. Damn. Nigga busted his chin. He slipped and fell and busted his chin. I ain't gonna lie. I wouldn't show my face if that ever happened, bro. For real. Look like a gunshot God wound to damn. you. LOL, he's been on some weird shit lying for clout. He didn't have cancer and none of that either. Bro delusional for real. Next, bro delusional. Says, members only fucks with Kid Trunks anymore. He's been on damn. some weirdo shit lately. Don't believe a word he says. Damn. He fell in the airport a while ago. That's why he'd been going to the hospital. He just Yo, goddamn, this nigga on his dick. Yo, he like he is telling his entire story. That pick save so he can post it later for clout. He needs to grow up and quit lying for sympathy. Shit is corny. Ooh. We don't claim him. I mean, this Ooh. guy DJ Dabs even goes as far as to say that X Damn. would be disgusted by the way Trunks has been acting. And you know, that's his words, not mine. I mean, I'm sure the whole that's group kind of knows if this is bullshit or not. And they kind of just been Nigga watching told, on like what he said on it. X. He, he like he that he put that on X. The fuck? And Nigga, someone's just finally damn. calling out the cap. I mean, this guy even took to Instagram to talk his shit. He says, so you mean to tell me this was recent like he claimed? He got red hair in the FaceTime he posted with Noah Cyrus last night, but in this pic, his hair is black. Damn. And there's the Noah Cyrus picture that he posted just for reference. So he dyed his hair after getting shot? Stop the cap. This kid damn. needs mental help. Honestly, this is the third time he lied about something for sympathy and clout. He fell and busted his chin in the airport. And someone also- and all the niggas. All the niggas is telling on this nigga, bro. Oh my God. I would literally leave the earth if this happened, bro. I found this picture Kid Trunks had posted where it looks like he might have stitches, but I don't know. That kind of looks like a tattoo. Yeah, Either it way, it even just makes the story a little bit more sus. Bro got I thought bigger this picture too. that he posted to his story yesterday was funny. Okay, he says Kid- Bro got all 20s. I mean- Trunks let me chill, off. let me Kid chill, Trunks let me chill. Sucks. Kid Trunks is broke for motivational purposes only. And this motherfucker is actually out here flexing $20 bills. I mean, this can't be more than like, I don't know, $10,000. I mean, it's not a crazy amount of money at all, especially True. for a rapper. He was also out here trying to do some cheap fuck features. Fuck all negativity. You know, he's saying, fuck all the negativity, let's get this money. And Trunks even went on Instagram live after being shot with this guy named Speedy. Okay. Somebody said that's Ooh, that bandage is hella clean for a gunshot wound. There's hella blood under here. I don't know if you see this, but obviously after I get shot on my chin, I'm going to clean that shit off the rips. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? How is he even talking if he got fucking shot under the chin? Like, what the fuck? You guys see how defensive he always is about these things that apparently happened Come to him? On, bro. I mean, this guy's really claiming that that's how they bandaged him up after he was popped oh, in the face God. with a gun. What Stop looks like actually pop. happened to so me cringy. was that he went to Wendy's and got like a bunch of napkins. He was way too many napkins. And then got some medical tape and tied it that around his neck funny. and just stuffed the napkins in there. I'm I mean, he looks I'm absolutely ridiculous. I ain't playing. I'm dropping, dropping, I'm taking over. In my opinion, he'll do abs. Nigga said, I'm dropping, I'm dropping, I'm taking over. Taking over what, bro? Uh -huh. 
absolutely anything let's, for clout. Let's be honest, and I'm bro. thinking he might be going broke, to be honest with you guys. But like I said, this has all been my opinion. This has all been pure speculation. I and many others just found this whole story sketchy. You know, a lot of you guys sent me I mean, a lot of this duh. information, so I thank you. And to Kid Trunks, if you're watching this video, I 100% invite you and encourage you to come on the channel and to explain what's going on. Because a lot of your fans have Why a lot of questions. That, bro? Either Be way, serious, I'll leave it bro. open to you guys down below in the comments to let me know what you guys think. As always, I do want to thank you guys for watching today's video, sharing with I a mean, friend, and dropping a like. It, it, this video is cool, but like, even though he was clout chasing the nigga in the video, is also dig riding. Just, just being honest.